Hello and welcome to Higher Ground Gaming. This is Eric. Today we're going to do another, well, not really unboxing, but unwrapping, unwrap, unraveling of uh, some um, wallet size games that we pledged on Kickstarter through Button Shy Games. Um, just wanted to give you a little background on this. Um, we actually inadvertently um, had the wrong address, had an old address from like five years ago um, in our. Um, some, somehow in the uh, pledge manager or something. So it got sent there and we never received it. Uh, unfortunately, we weren't able to to go to the other address to find out what happened to it. So uh, we contacted Button Shy Games uh, through the Kickstarter and um, I want to thank Jason um, Tagmar, I think it is. Uh, I think that's your last name. Sorry if I, <laughs> I forgot. I think that's who it is. But the uh, the the uh, developer and well, the owner of uh, Button Shy Games there, and uh, he graciously uh, resent the whole order out um, to me, and I just got it got it uh, yesterday. So I wanted to thank Button Shy Games, and if you haven't checked them out, check them out. They do a bunch of cool wallet size type games, um, which is you know an X amount of cards. I think it's like sixteen or eighteen cards. So we'll find out when we open them up. But I just wanted to showcase, and these were uh, reprints. Of games that were um, that had gone out of stock, so uh, yeah. So let, without further ado, let's show you which games we decided to get. And um, again, thank you to uh, Button Shy Games. Check them out if you haven't yet. Um, they're always doing Kickstarters too. So plus they have their own website, which you can order the games from. So all right, so here it is. This is what we got in the mail uh, yesterday. Like I said. So let's open it up and uh, show you what it is. Not really much of an unboxing here. It's just basically showing you what's inside. So they came in this bag right here. Yeah, didn't have to waste a lot of packing material, although the envelope was nice and padded. So thank you for that. So as you can see that why they call button um, wallet size games is because they can basically fit in your back pocket just like a wallet would. In fact, they could be wallets themselves. So the three games that we got are, whoops, sorry, let me uh, get this back up there, is uh, Stu, uh, an RPG called Twin Stars Adventure Series 1, Jason Tagmeyer, there it is. Um, and uh, it's an RPG type game. They have an Adventure Series 2. And finally, Banned books. So those are the three games that we decided to back there. You could have gotten anywhere from one to five or six games, I think. Um, we decided somewhere in the middle with three. And we get to vote on the games, which is really cool, which games were going to be reprinted. So that was awesome. But this is the first game that we decided on was Stew. And basically, it's a card game, like I said. Let's get right here. So there it is. So it fits right in a little wallet here. So let me... Uh, let me show you what's inside here. So it's got the instruction booklet, which is really cool. So it's two to four players, ages uh, eight and over, 15 minutes. Gives a little overview of the game. So basically you're gonna be building stews and stuff like that. And um, when you reach a certain score, I think you're gonna call stew and uh, Tally up your points, and if you get a certain amount of points without the animals eating your stew, then I think you win. I think that's basically um, what it amounts to. So, yeah, so quick reference here. So, a nice little instruction manual. And then the cards themselves right here. So, here are your cards, which I'll show you. All right, so you got a potato, and a potato. Three potatoes, four potatoes, carrots, garlic, and garlic. And then the other side, you have more cards. So you have stones, leeks, leeks, chickens, foxes, boars, gophers, rabbits, raccoons, and vagabonds. We'll be with you just in a minute. So let me count here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 cards. So it's 18 cards in the game. So we'll write with you and then we'll, we'll do the next game. We'll show you that one. 
All right, and our next game is going to be Twin Stars, which is, like I said, is a role-playing type game, a card game. And again, it's another 18-card game, which fits in the back of your wallet. Um, so nice little games. And this one by Jason Tagmar and Mike Mullins. So I will show you what's inside. So that's what right there. You got the instructions and then the cards. And I think you do need to add die to this one. So you have to have die, um, which I have plenty of. So I think this is a solo game. You might be able to play two players possibly, but we'll see. So basically how to play, additional rules. And basically that's it. Roll a dice, place the dice. Resolve instants, resolve effects, check for combos. And that's pretty much the game right there. Yeah, so this one is a single player game. Which is nice to take with you if you're going on a trip or, you know, get some time to kill at the doctor's office or something. Dentist or something like that. Or if you're social isolating like people are doing now. So these are the cards. So, yeah, these are your uh, enemies. So, yeah, that guy, uh, the, the Bood, the in Inpon Goal, the Rock Guard, Grant, Rock Gardener. Or I was Jastamina, whatever that is. Yanfra Jima. It gives a little description on So these are your enemies that you're fighting. And then some more. And I think these are all enemy cards here. Your Stag Solar, your Streza Sawyer, your Izzel May. They all got wacky names. And then these are your missions I think you have to try to do. Escape the Brig. Confine the Quarks. Rule the World. Stop the virus. <laughs> That's appropriate for today. Steal the plants. Hunt the bounty. So again, another little, um, I think it's 18 cards. I'll count them again. I think it's 18. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yep, so 18 cards. I think that's the uh, rule they have here. For the, They have to be 18 cards. And then finally, um, banned books. This is by Jason Tagmeyer. So, the, again, the owner. And uh, here are your instruction manual here. So, this is a one player. It looks like it, this looks like it might be another solo game. I know the other, uh, the banned books, I mean, the uh, stew game is a multiplayer game. But I think this one, these two other ones might be, maybe uh, solo games. Nothing wrong with that. And here we go. So it looks like this one is a, a guy. He's got special powers. So another one here. Another guy. So first guy is Atticus. This guy is Guy. This guy is Huck. Jerry. So he's eating a candy bar or something. Uh, Sally or Cecily. Alice. Tom and Bernard. And then looks like he's got some more guys here. Holden, Lenny, and then these are probably, I think these are parts of the games right here. So I think you got to try to do something with the books there, I guess. And there you have abilities. You have heal, flip, stall. I think these are the different things you can do in the game. And again, this is another 18 um, page game, 18 uh, card game. So that's it. So that is all of them. So you have stew, and books, and twin star. Those are your three books that we ordered. They they do have a lot of other games. Um, Circle of Wagons is one game that we're probably eventually going to order, um, along with a couple other. I think Metropolis or something, some city building card game looks looks really good too. Um, but that's it. Just a short little video on some. Cool little 10, 15 minute games. Some you can play solo, some you can play with others. Um, I think the other two games I mentioned you can play with others too, or you can play by yourself. So some good times here, especially with the quarantine and everything going on here. Nice simple games you can pick up and play um, with anyone or with yourself. So that's it. So it's been Eric from Higher Ground Gaming with another board game unboxing. Oh, this is more of just a revealing. But we'll see you in the next uh unboxing video uh hopefully we get some games coming soon so take care and god bless bye bye now